everyone, it's Vanessa. Welcome back to another vlog. So this is actually week two in my four-part vlog week series. I'm doing a 30-day self-care challenge and today's vlog is the second week of my self-care challenge. So I didn't actually talk or do a really like vlog vlog of yesterday. I kind of just was showing you clips of yesterday's self-care challenge because I actually spent the day with Alan. Yesterday's self-care challenge, as you would have saw, was to go try a new coffee shop. Honestly, one of my favorite things, especially living in the city, we have so many good local coffee shops and Alan and I both wanted to just go for a nice walk. It was such a beautiful day outside. I think it was actually only like three degrees, so fairly warm for the winter, but we went for a walk down by the lake and then went and grabbed coffee and we found this coffee shop called Deneen. I believe that's how you pronounce it. There's about three of them, I think, in Toronto. And so I honestly, I fell in love. I'm obsessed. I'm gonna have to go back. But yeah, we just grabbed coffee, grabbed lunch yesterday, and that was kind of the day. We didn't do a whole lot, but like I didn't really talk vlog at all. It was kind of cold and I didn't want to get my camera out, but today I actually started classes again because just winter semester has started today. And so I wanted today's self-care challenge to be really easy so that I can kind of get back into a school groove and school routine. So literally the only challenge of self-care that I made for myself to do today is to go on Pinterest and just feel my inspiration. I love doing that on a weekly basis anyways, so I thought it would be just a great little thing. I could sit down for 30 minutes and just pin to some of my boards and do that today because I love doing that, whether it's like home inspo, goal inspo, like clothing, fashion inspo, whatever. I love just being able to sit down and fuel my goals and personally it's such a self-care thing for me just to scroll on Pinterest and save inspiration. So that is today's since I have a few classes. It is currently it's currently 11.30 a.m. I had class from 8 till 11 this morning and then after this I have class from 12 till 2 and then I am going to take a break and do my little self-care. But yeah, I thought I'd just give you guys a little update on the self-care challenge, what is happening. That is yesterday's and today's, so day six and today's day seven, I believe. So that is what is up. Also, um, I'm gonna give you an outfit today because even though I'm at home, I got dressed, no makeup, but like I got dressed, I'm feeling kind of cute. <laughs> This is the bumpy kind of outfit. I'm just wearing this little bra top that I tie-dyed myself in the summer. And I actually got this for Christmas, but it's literally just an oversized Gildan hoodie. It's a size large. I don't have any zip-up hoodies, but I thought it'd be cute just kind of lounge in. And then just some Nike black leggings. But yeah, I, you know, every so often you gotta get dressed and put yourself together. And I feel like I'm just gonna have a lot better routine with school this semester, or like I'm trying to get into a better routine. But... Yeah, that is what is up. everyone so I saved today's a little self-care challenge for tonight because I had another full day of school and I also decided to give myself a little hair trim it was feeling a little dead so we did that but today's challenge is to try a new tea and I got this one for Christmas actually from Alan's parents 
and it's just this apple orange cinnamon blend so i'm just kind of having a little relaxed night i like i said i had a shower washed my hair cut my hair i am lighting some candles currently and just going to sit down relax kind of plan out the rest of the week hopefully plan out the rest of january and start planning february and yeah just have a little chill planning night if i hadn't gotten because I, I actually made up this whole challenge back middle of december if i hadn't gotten a new tea i would have went out and purchased like a random tea to try but it just so happened that i got a new tea for christmas so that kind of worked out perfectly but you guys also saw it's a super fancy loose leaf tea it smells so good and i'm so excited to try out that tea i'll let you guys know how it is day nine and I'm very excited for today because today's challenge is to start listening to a new podcast and I actually started listening to two new podcasts today so Alan and I are starting this one podcast and it's called the 10 minute hour bible podcast I believe that's what it's called it's going through the book of Matthew and we just wanted to start listening to that one together so we actually started listening to that one today and then finally I also started listening to the Morning Ray podcast with Alani B. Fit or Alana Bloomberg. She's a fellow TikToker who is also in Toronto and I finally started to listen to her podcast. It's so good. I am obsessed with it. So I just finished listening to episode one of both of those, both this little one here, the 10 minute hour Bible podcast and then I'm not the most active podcast listener but these are just a few of the ones that I listen to I definitely one of my goals this year was to start listening to more podcasts so I will be adding more to this list but those are just a few of the ones that I have listened to or liked listening to before but otherwise it's another full day of classes for me and yeah, I think actually I'm going to reorganize my bookshelf because I got a few new books for Christmas and I wanted to just spice up. There's one shelf on my shelf in my bedroom that I wanted to spice up, so I'm going to do that later, but right now I have some classes. another not beautiful day but beautiful day today it's not beautiful outside but it is a beautiful day it is about halfway through the day it's around 1 p.m. I'm actually going to go for a little walk and drop off some Ceres Dawn packages at the post office the just orders that have come in last night and this morning and yesterday um, but yeah I have to go drop those off at the post office this morning I was actually finishing up some summer research applications so i was finishing up those to try and get them in as fast as possible like i want to be early so the researchers can see that i am prompt and i am ready and yeah just you know work stuff um work school science stuff i actually haven't chosen today's little goal task yet i'm gonna have to look at the list and pick one because i yeah i just i've been so focused on those applications that i didn't really have one chosen for today but that's currently what is up. So I decided that today I'm gonna do the brain dump. I've just been feeling pretty anxious these last few days, so I feel like it's a good time to just let it all out. And I think it's mainly just cause school started again and you know, all of that, but it's time to do that.
wanted to get all dressed and you know put on some makeup and feel all put together today um, my little goal challenge for today is to watch no TV because I have been binge watching suits and just really take like the time to enjoy my daily routines and like the little things in my day so I'm actually going grocery shopping gonna spend a good time in the grocery store honestly I love doing that just like wandering the grocery store that probably sounds really weird but like I find it so soothing um yeah that, that's it today is just don't watch any TV but like I can still obviously got social media and YouTube and you know but like no actual TV but here is the outfit for the day I just put on my super high-waisted Zara jeans and then this little M boutique bodysuit brown has been my favorite color recently to wear I feel like it suits me really well Today's little self-care goal challenge is to clean out my closet and go through all of my drawers and stuff, clean out this guy. Just I know there's more stuff that I can get rid of and I can donate or I can put up on Poshmark, like go through all these drawers here too. I've already done a little bit so far as you guys would have just seen. Yeah, I just, I don't know, I feel like my drawers and stuff have gotten cluttered recently and it always just is a good little like mental relax de-stress to like go through and declutter stuff so that is what today's little challenge is and yeah and I also get to be able to donate and you know get rid of things that I don't use out of it so I was able to fill this full box with stuff that I want to get rid of or put on Poshmark it's a fair amount of stuff so I'm happy that I'm able to clear out some more things that I don't wear from my closet So today's goal was just to make a little gratitude list. I'm definitely going to fill this page as well, but this is what I have so far. Just some things that I'm thankful for. Yeah, that's all. I feel like gratitude really is a way that you can just appreciate life a little bit more and all the little things in your life. But yeah, definitely something to do on a more daily thing, just like little gratitudes every day. It is in the stars. This of week two of my little self-care challenge. 
So this morning I wanted to do an addition to my morning routine. That is the little goal challenge. And so I actually added two new things. First one is I'm gonna start making daily to-do lists just to help with productivity. And even if they're just like little, little tiny tasks, like do a load of laundry today or like, you know, like little things. And then also I started doing a daily devotional this morning, as you would have seen, it's just that little pink book. But yeah, those are two additions to my morning routine that I have started. But I hope you guys enjoyed this week's self-care challenge. Be sure to stay tuned for week three and week four. But I am signing off from this week and I will see you all in the next video. I love you guys so much. Bye.